Brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. In this video, we're going to show you how to remove the driver's side front door panel on this 2004 Dodge Stratus, same as any 01 to 06. Tools you'll need are a small flat blade screwdriver, a Phillips screwdriver, and some type of flat tool like a putty knife or a door panel clip tool. I use a small flat blade screwdriver, and down in the pull cup here, pry up a little trap door. There's a little Phillips screw in there. And then in behind your uh, door handle, there's another Phillips screw in there. Okay, and then there's three Phillips screws, one there, 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 and then one on the back edge here. Okay, just going to fast forward as I use a Phillips screwdriver and remove six screws in all. Okay, this triangle up here can just pull out. A uh, little, all you need is a uh, putty knife. Kind of get down in behind the door panel here, slide it down, pull it up, and start to pull the things. Up. Right here is your lock harness. The little button, press on that, disconnect. And on your latch rod, there's a clip. Just going to reach it in behind with my finger. Pull that clip off, and the rod comes up and off. And then lastly, down here. Okay, lastly down here is your window um, harness. There's a button right in the middle. You really got to push that button and then work the harness out. Okay, and your door panel's off. Once your door panel's off, you want to check these aqua clip pins here because there could be pins stuck inside them. Use a pair of uh, needle nose pliers, pull the pins out, and then reinstall them on, on the inside of your door panel. Door panel back on. First, reconnect your power window switch. Make sure it clicks. Bring it close. Reconnect your power door locks. Okay. Take this rod, put it into the hole. And then slip the clip. Right around, flip it on. Okay, make sure your lock goes through. There is a large locating tab, goes into a big hole. Once you've got that, okay, make sure your pins go in. Cheat back, make sure all the pins go in correctly. Matter of replacing all the Phillips screws. Okay, so we'll speed up as we replace all those screws. And there was one down in the door cup behind the door panel, uh, three at the bottom, and then one at the back. We hope this helps you out. Brought to you by www.1aauto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Please feel free to call us toll free 888-844-3393. We're the company that's here for you on the internet and in person.